Accentuate the positive on Jazz at 6, especially on a Monday, and you do it with the blues. The Monk Jackson Blues, Milt Jackson Blues, you know, just on the money. From the album The Prophet Speaks, and he's talking to Bubba and you on Jazz at 6. I'm never supporting K-Jazz. We'll let uh, Dave Brubeck take us right up to the top of the hour. Thank you for making us a part of your day. And don't forget, all the music you hear on Jazz at 6, it's on our website, right over there in the playlist. Just remember the day you got the time. Jazz at 6 with BWB on KJazz 88.1. <laughs> Thank <laughs> you. 
فرمائی کرد I call the uh, regular city council meeting for Monday, August 12, 2013, to order. Councilman Levitt, would you please lead us in the Pledge of Allegiance? Anyone please rise. Please hand over your heart. Repeat after me. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. The city clerk, would you please call the roll? Mayor Miller? Here. Mayor Pro Tem Deaton? Councilman Levitt? Here. Councilman Shanks? Here. Councilman Swan? Here. With no objections, I will so order that Mayor Pro Tem Deaton is be excused from tonight's meeting. Approval of agenda and waiver of full reading of resolutions and ordinances. By motion of the City Council, this is the time to notify the public of any changes to the agenda and or rearrange the order of the agenda. Ms. City Manager, are there any changes to the agenda? No changes tonight, Mayor. Mr. City Attorney, have you any changes? Not tonight. Do any members of the Council wish to make any changes? No. No. Okay. Is there a motion to approve the agenda as presented? Move the agenda be approved as read. Second. Please vote. That passes four to zero. There are no presentations or recognitions tonight. All communications. At this time, members of the public may address the council regarding any items within the subject matter jurisdiction of the City Council. Pursuant to the Brown Act, the Council cannot discuss or take any action on any items not on the agenda unless authorized by law. Matters not, uh, matters not on the agenda at the Council's discretion may be referred to staff and placed on a future agenda. Those members of the public wishing to speak are asked to come forward to the microphone and state their name for the record. All speakers will be limited to five minutes. Any documentation for, a re for a review should be sent to the City Clerk for distribution. Anyone who wishes to address the City Council, please come to the podium. Okay, seeing no one, I declare all communications is now closed. Mr. City Attorney, do you have a report? No. Ms. City Manager, do you have a report? Yes, Mayor. Thank you. Just have one item tonight. Um, as the Council and the public will recall we had a fantastic national night out uh, last Tuesday evening. I know the Mayor was there. Um, so I'd just like the Chief to briefly hit some of the high points of the evening. Chief? Last Thursday was the 30th anniversary of National Night Out celebrated across the nation. What originally started as a way for communities to take back some of their parks, take back parts of the inner city, uh, where the, the police department would host an event sponsored by the city, and you'd go back and show the gang members or the drug dealers that this park is ours, it's not yours. That was the kind of the initial theory. In our community, however, though, it's more of a celebration of the existing partnerships between city departments, elected officials, all our community groups, um, just everyone, how well we work together in the city. It was a fantastic event. Target sponsored, as they always do, giving away hot dogs and sodas and water. And I do not have a count on the hot dogs yet, but I'm estimating probably about 2,000 hot dogs given out. Uh, but I should firm that number up soon. But it was a great event, and I want to thank everyone for the support. Uh, lifeguards, Public Works, everybody was out there just highlighting what we do and how well we work with the community every day. Thank you, Chief. That's all I have tonight. Okay. Councilman Shanks, do you have any comments? Uh, the only thing I'd... Uh, Chief of Police Joe has announced on a call that they've... Apparently, the police have arrested the burner who's been hitting the hill. And I think our police do a fantastic job and need to be content, <laughs> commended for capturing this man. Thank you. Councilman Swan. Thank you. Yes, sir, Mr. Mayor. I had the opportunity to go to Leisure World this week and observe some of the bathroom uh, developments where they've been doing the, the uh, makeover of the bathrooms and the showers. And I can tell you it's a wonderful program. We were actually providing a higher quality of life for people because they can now get in and out of the shower without falling. And the people, I might say, 
are in love with the city of Seal Beach because they, they would not be able to afford this on their own. And I think it's a wonderful program, and I hope that we continue it. In fact, they have such a high opinion of the city of Seal Beach, I'm sure they don't uh, mind us saying we're from the government and we, we can help you. <laughs> <laughs> Councilman Levin. No. Okay, I, I would just like to thank staff for their hard work and improving their successful efforts to improve the Lampson median and the College Park East entrances. I'm especially... I especially find the medians very attractive now. If anybody's not seen those, you should go out and take a look at the, I guess some people call them boulders, I call them rocks and the flowers. It's a very beautiful situation. You wonder where the, where is the mountain stream? Anyway, thank you very much, Sean and Michael. Um, okay, going down to the consent calendar. Items on the consent calendar are considered to be routine and are enacted by one single motion with the exception of items previously polled by the council. Nothing's been polled, so is there a motion to approve the consent calendar as presented? So moved. Second. Please vote. That's approved four to zero. Okay, there is no, there's not a public hearing tonight. There's no unfinished or continued business. There's no new business. So Mr. we're adjourned. Mr. Mayor, before you adjourn. Oh. Sir? Who said that? I did. I apologize. Okay. We have a resident who showed up for public comment, unfortunately stepped out of the room for that time. I was wondering if you could reopen it so he could speak. Sure. Public comment's open. Please state your name for the record. My name is Rockwell Mann, and uh, I've been uh, kind of investigating around of, about carts in Seal Beach. Uh, I've been on these people who have been there for years, never even seen a cart. I mean, like a hot dog cart, you know, and I would like to know if it would be possible that uh, we could get that to, uh, I'd like to open a, a, a cart right on the pier, just a cart. That's all, no, no, nothing else but just hot dogs, that's it. And I want to know if that, that could be possible that we could get permission to uh, do that. Mr. City Manager, please Sir. address that. Sir, if we can just make sure you leave your contact information with the city clerk, we'll have a staff member get back to you. Okay. And I got 400 people that like my idea anyway. <laughs> uh, what do we leave it with? Uh, right Okay, we're going to adjourn with no objection. The City Council meeting is adjourned to Monday, August 26, 2013, at 6 p.m. to meet in closed session if deemed necessary. We are adjourned. <laughs>